Good morning trendsetters, Dano here from Dano's channel, back at you. Oh, one more again. Alright, I've managed to pick myself up one of these little GME XRS Bluetooth modules. They allow you to convert your uh, existing XRS, uh, better 330, 370 or 390C radio, into a, a Bluetooth hands-free module. So, this little unit here just goes between the handpiece and the radio itself and it allows you to uh, connect your, your UHF radio to the Bluetooth audio in your car or um, if you're wearing earbuds or headphones while you're, while you're driving so you, you, know, you want a little bit of privacy you can you listen to your radio through that it also allows you to um, to speak hands-free it comes with a uh, an external microphone which you can clip up in your vehicle or something like that and now uh, yeah just push a button on your steering wheel and you can you know, transmit that way so without too much more buggerizing around let's um we'll bang this in and we'll give it a whirl all right let's have a look at what comes in the box and we'll crack that open right, the first thing i see is the little module so that's what it looks like there it's not very big as you can see uh, same plug as what's on the end of your microphone so you disconnect the microphone from the uh, the XRS unit itself this plugs in it's important that this is the first thing that does plug into your XRS module for it to work properly you've also got a uh, another input here for your microphone and on the other side there's an input there which allows you to have a, um, a wired push to talk if you like so if you wanted to have uh, a hard mounted button on your dashboard that allows you to, to activate it you can do it that way as well all right it also comes with a uh, microphone and i suppose this is one of the main parts of the unit this one here is a steering wheel mounted button so this allows you to to trip your microphone without taking your hands off the wheel so um, that can also be popped out of this unit uh, put in your pocket or whatever if you're walking around. I, I know that uh, GME are going to be releasing a um, XRS handheld uh, shortly into the new year, so um, this this should work with that as well. So uh, yeah, all right. Without too much more buggerizing around, let's get into putting it in and give it a bit of a whirl. I know I don't know how well you can see that up up in there, but that's. Uh, plug that we're going to disconnect and then we're going to slip our little unit in between so let's get that done not a lot of room up under my dash where I've got my radio mounted so it can be a little bit difficult to get to all right so that's that plug out so all we need to do now is plug that into our unit and take the other end and plug that into our into our base just like that now I'm going to secure this with a little bit of double sided tape up in there after I've connected my external mic input into it so let's get that done there's my external mic so I'm just going to plug that into the unit so um, the great thing about these is no no wiring to be done. It's all all plug and play. So now I'm just going to mount that up in here with some double sided tape, put my dashboard back together, and then mount the the steering wheel module. All right, so that's our little steering wheel module. So to mount that, we'll just undo these couple of little hex screws and fit that over our steering wheel. does come with a, a rubber insert for the older steering wheels that aren't quite as as thick as the, the modern ones so for the time being I'm just going to mount mine up here that'll be a reasonably comfortable position for me and it won't be in the way of anything
All right. Yeah, that feels pretty good. One of the, the good things with these these little modules is you can, on the back, you can just unclip it, take that bung out, and that lets you take the button out all together. So if you wanted to take it out somewhere, let's say you were doing a, a winch recovery or something like that, you needed to be outside the vehicle where you couldn't easily reach your handheld, uh, yeah, you can have that in your pocket and give it a push. Yeah. All right, let's move on to um, setting it up in the XRS app and um, updating the firmware if need be. All right, we've got our module all installed on the uh, steering wheel, mounted where we want it. Look, I can always move it later. I might move it down here or something. I'll just see how it goes. Next thing that we've got to do is pair the BT1 with your XRS radio. Now, before you go to do that, it's very important that you make sure that the firmware on your XRS is all up to date because there's some menu options in that that you need that you won't have if you don't have the latest firmware. All right, to pair the BT1 to your GME, we're just going to push the menu button on the handpiece. Once we're in the menu, we're going to scroll down into Bluetooth, menu button to select that again. Once we're in here, we're going to go down to visible devices select that currently says none so what we need to do now is put our uh, bt1 into pairing mode so to do that we just push the button on the bt1 and you should see xrs ptt pops up on our um, our little menu there all right we're going to select and connect to that once you see that little asterisk come up on the screen there, you'll know that it's it's paired to the unit. If we back out of that, if you want to make sure that it has successfully paired, just pop up into paired devices, select menu, and you can see there it is. Let's back out of that, Let's go back to our main screen. You can see the little Bluetooth icon up there saying that it's all connected to our radio and all that. All right, now if I push the button, You'll see the little transmit button up here, or transmit indicator up here in the corner illuminates. There you go, and that's all there is to it. All right. Once again, it's very important that you make sure that your firmware is all up to date, otherwise you're not going to have those menu options. It'll, it'll create a real headache for you. If you have enjoyed today's video, please um, give us the old thumbs up. Uh, like and share and if you're not already subscribed subscribe for us it is free thank you very much all right i'll see you on the next one bye for now